this is our new building in St. Augustine, Florida. It's 150,000 square feet. We purchased it in April of 2014, began renovations, and moved our entire staff in on January 1st of 2015. One of the reasons we're really proud of our line is we took a lot of time on the front end designing it. We invited in PPG, our powder supplier, as well as Bulk Chemical. We sat in a room for a little over eight hours, looked at all the parts we did, the quantities, uh, the sizes, and we built the line to handle the profiles that we do the most, but also to handle profiles for our higher margin products like our large commercial industrial gates. Once we got out of the room and finished going back and forth designing the line, we put it all into one eight-page document, and myself and Michael Siegel, the other owner of Ideal, we went to Fabtech in October 2013 and met with, I think it was about four, maybe five equipment houses that we were going to ask to bid on building the line. The, the advantage we had is we had an eight-page document that described exactly what we wanted. So when we walked into Fabtech, we were a great lead. Everybody was looking forward to working with us. The market really hadn't come back yet, so there was a lot of interest in our line. Uh, we narrowed it down to three. All three were great uh, and would have been good, uh, good uh, to work with. Numec sort of stepped ahead and we felt comfortable with them and we've partnered with Numec and Nordson to build the line that we designed. So our customer base is really divided. Uh, obviously we do a good bit of residential, uh, backyard, pool code, fence. Uh, well, how we differentiate ourselves is we really like the complicated custom items. Uh, we do a lot of commercial and industrial cantilever and estate gates. Um, and that's really been the success of our business is being able to diversify it, have those commodity-based items like the backyard residential, but also offer our customers a breadth of product lines in the fence, gates, and railing um, markets. And it's been successful. We've, uh, we've been growing since we bought the business, and it looks like it's going to continue to grow.